Hey guys, Brother Steve coming to you. Uh, just a little short lunchbox message today. I uh, thought I had a thought on my mind. You see, I had surgery uh, about a month ago, and they gave me the happy juice or whatever to put you to sleep. And uh, I thought I, I looked up at the nurse, and the next thing I know, I'm waking up in recovery. And that's what got on my mind is, you know, we when we go to sleep at night, we can't remember the exact moment or what time we fell asleep. And, I mean, we've got an ideal, but, uh, you see, we go to sleep, and we don't know anything until we wake up or get woke up in the middle of the night. And I thought that that's how, uh, when death comes to our door, we're not going to have time to wake up and pray and make things right. We need to make sure today that we're saved. Amen. We need to make sure before we go to sleep, before we do anything, we need to make sure that the blood of Jesus is applied to our lives and washed our sins away. Amen. The Bible says it's appointed unto man once to die and after this to judgment. Uh, once we die, we don't have time to uh, make things right. Once we close our eyes for the final time, take our last breath, we don't have time to make things right. We need to do so now, today, before it's everlasting too late. Amen. Who can you be saved by? Nobody but the name of Jesus. Through and by Jesus. Amen. You've got to have Jesus. Amen. That's what I had on my mind today. Whatever you do today, make sure that you've got your name written in the Lamb's Book of Life. Amen. Make sure today, amen, before you take your final breath that you've been saved by the blood and washed by the blood of Jesus. Amen. That's what's on Brother Steve's heart today. Whatever you do, wherever you might go today, whatever your plans may be, make sure that you are saved. Amen. Y'all have a wonderful and blessed day. Until next time, Jesus loves you. God bless you.